This is a continuation of the one line creation tutorial. In this tutorial, what we want to cover are insert subsystems. EasyPower allows you to create a number of different subsystems. These can be designs that you use over and over and over again, or they could just be standards, such as standards that you would use for a specific client. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a 300 kVA UPS plus gen and when I left mouse click it automatically comes into the diagram. So now what I can do is I can highlight this, move it, connect it up to this breaker and now I have a UPS with bypass, automatic transfer switch and emergency generator all connected to my critical load supply. So it's a simple, easy, one-click process. I can add different templates. Here's a Cutler Hammer 1000 KVA unit sub. Click it in, and we have a pre-designed, already checked out by the engineering group, uh, subsystem that your designers or technicians can snap in and create one lines. Another thing we want to look at is I'm going to go back to the home page and I'm going to click on the Easy Power button and read in another file. Easy Power is file based, not folder based. That allows us to read in as many files as we choose. So I go to Window, Tile Vertically, and you'll see that we have multiple drawings. So I can highlight equipment items from one drawing, right mouse click, copy, come over to another drawing, right mouse click, paste, and now I have an identical unit in both files. That is one of the really cool things. So this file-based system, we can open a dozen different files at a time. You can copy and paste from files. You can send your files to clients or your other field offices. You don't have to package up an FTP site of 100 megabytes of a folder. It's, it's very simple to uh, transfer in and out.